Hello, people, and welcome back. So, as I said before, um, you know, we, uh, we're definitely going to continue recording once I found a jungle biome, and there was actually one a lot closer than I thought. Uh, so, there was also a change since the last recording. Um, I had to remove a mod, uh, Mousy's Mobs. Yeah, it, it was causing some major problems. It was basically the entire reason for that entire freezing bug. Oh, shit. Unusual noise that I normally don't hear. I don't know. I'm just going to hurry up and harvest these cocoa beans. See about a jungle sapling. Mm. I'm hearing some crazy noise. I know what they are. It's they're called the Miramax. I don't really see any of them. Come on, I need a jungle set. Come on, stop screwing around. Uh, yeah, but I did wind up removing Mousy's mobs. Uh, it's just because it was causing some problems. Obviously, that was the main reason. Um, wait, did... Yes, jungle sapling. Okay. Uh, good. So I have some jungle wood. I have a jungle sapling. More than enough. Okay. So. Jungle wood, jungle saplings. Uh, let's see, what else? Uh, I already got melons. For a fact, I have cocoa beans. Is there anything else I'm missing? I mean, obviously, there's a bunch of things I'm still missing, but none immediately come to mind. Yeah, I, I guess we just go home from here, honestly. Um, you know? Yeah, but this is part of the Miramax hive here. Uh, see, those are some of the Miramax right there. They're uh, soldiers, from what I understand. Um, yeah. I can actually make them my friends if I give them some stuff they like. Uh, I don't remember off the top of my head what they actually like, though. So, maybe kind of hard. Um, but yeah. And these are, uh, these are the snow villagers. They're, uh, they're pretty cool. Unlike normal villagers, they will actually kill shit. And that's a nice dragon corpse over there. That's a polar bear. I don't 
think I've ever actually seen a polar bear in Minecraft before. That's cool. Never saw a polar bear before, but now I have. Oh well. Oh, and there's llamas over here too. Hmm. I wonder if llamas offer if llamas offer any unique benefits. Sheep and other shit. You know, I'm starting to wonder where all those dragon eggs are. I mean, I know they're supposed to generate in extreme hills biomes, mountain biomes. All I've been seeing, though, is griffins. bit of lag, but nothing as bad as we were before. If I can find a dragon egg, now that would be an impressive feat. But I haven't seen any signs of any nests. Fly over to this little cliff here. I don't see anything that resembles a dragon nest up here. And damn, it's big here. I mean, seriously, this is this is ow. trying to kill me. I need to get away from him. Yeah, good. He's out of loaded chunks, therefore he will stop following me. Now, which way is back to... Oh, that's a red dragon. No, I don't want to go back that way. Oh, yeah. Holmes is right. Wait a minute. Whoa, 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 what was that? Okay, never mind. It's just a griffin. Yeah. No signs of any dragon eggs. The, the nests are very easy to spot. I mean, they're almost like, uh, well, the best way I could describe it is round. Well, Ra as round as you can get in Minecraft, I suppose. Lots of griffins in these mountains, though. We might need to turn down their spawn rate. 
say that, but only after I got my own griffin. This is another thing we can start growing. Now that I have cocoa beans, it'll be even easier to fill my belly. <laughs> strip all of your armor off and then get you back inside so you can't fly away like a flippity gibbet like you did last time. seem to be having some kind of momentary lag here, but it passes. Mm. I should make some bottles. Ooh, and I should also make uh, another um, golden lasso. I have 11 levels now. That makes two golden lassos. <sighs> I'm going to need to use these. I also have a jungle sapling and some jungle wood and cocoa beans. So I'm thinking that I should put the cocoa beans outside. I should put them outside. Now where should I put them? Difficult decision. You know what? I'll put them in the basement, rather. There we go. There we go. Now we have cocoa beans. So that's cool. Our nether ward are growing nicely. Minions have not exactly been the best at their job. But you know, we have a plethora of resources to use. Now. Oh, right. I'm supposed to give you your armor back, aren't I? Wait, okay, what? Oh, right, right. That's right. I took your armor and stuff off because you were here. Okay. Makes sense. Uh, let's see. 
Well, you know what I'm thinking? I'm thinking it's time that I start dealing with some of my issues. Like, I'm having to fly around on these big, crazy birds that I like so much, of course. Uh, I, I don't think that's cool enough. I, I think I either need to get a dragon, or I need to grow some wings. And, as it just so happens, with this extra golden lasso, I can grow some wings. That's that's the wrong friggin' room. Okay. Now I have some ender pearls. Where did I put them? A glass cutter. Okay. Ender pearl. Diamonds there. Ooh, Ender Pearls. There we go. Okay. So, uh, I'll take a stack of that stuff. Oh my god, I just turned all my diamonds into Ender Pearls. Okay, I'll take two stacks of 16, and then I'm going to have to find a diamond to, uh, to, to fix that. Okay, come on. Where's the diamonds? No, no, I'm not out of diamonds. Do not tell me I'm out of friggin'... Oh, thank goodness I have a diamond. <laughs> I was going to be very upset for a second there, but luckily... Okay, okay. Let's not mix those that shit up again. Okay. So, now, uh, I have never had to power these rings before, so this is going to be interesting. Okay. So, I just used a glass cutter on these ender pearls. These ender shards are used to make resonating redstone crystals. Okay. So, let me get some redstone. Redstone. Okay. So. Use these. And this, I guess, is shown. Um, not really. Ah. Resonating redstone crystal. Yes. Okay, so it's just... Four. Resonating redstone crystals. Okay. Grid power, zero, zero. Uh, extra utilities manual. Uh, extra utilities manual. Okay, obsidian and gold and a book. Okay. Yeah, I think I could do that. Uh, book. You know, isn't this interesting? Every time I, I play a new way, uh, I find out new things. It's, it's astounding to me. Honestly, I should be bored of this game long ago, but there's always something new. Okay, got a gold bar. So, gold bar, a piece of obsidian. See what this handbook tells me here. Actually, you know, I'm going to read this handbook off camera because this should be uh, the end. Um, hey, congrats on episode 30, everybody. Yeah, it's a milestone. Uh, Charlie, get, give, give yourself some kind of cake or something. I'm not sure what, but, you know, be a good editor. Yeah. And uh, so I'll see you all later. Bye.